I mean, I don't even really know what happened. Like, I tackled him, and then I got up. Um, and the next thing you know, he was in the end zone. So it kind of it was like it all happened in a flash. Uh, then once when it stood, I just I mean, I, I was just happy to help out the defense and help out the team and, um, you know, get the game started off on the right foot. Stay ready so you, so you don't have to get ready. Mindset, how much did that apply? You didn't get as many snaps before, but you got a bunch today. Yeah, 100 percent. I think it's, you know, that's that's something that I'm I'm taking ownership of is just doing my job, you know, owning my role right now. And then um, as it adjusts, like uh, that's I got to embrace it 100 um, percent. And there's going to be there's going to be good plays that I make. There's going to be bad plays that I make but at the end of the day, like just on to the next play. So, uh, you know, I, I made the play, got to the sideline and then flushed it real quick. And then on to the next. Rabel was saying, I guess, before the game that your physicality would be big today against pretty physical offense. How much pride do you take in being a physical safety? Um, I, I take a lot of pride of it. It's not like I'm not like a, um, I don't bang my head against a locker before the game. It just kind of like come, it comes out whenever I play free. Uh, whenever I know what I'm doing, whenever I can digest the call and, and see the offense. After that, I can just kind of cut it loose. That's when I make my best play. That's when I'm stickiest in coverage and all that stuff. Like how you, how you assess how you guys do the defense as a whole. You get a couple of turnovers. You get a, a goal line stop. Also gave up some yards against the run. I mean, when you look back at this one, how do how you like how you guys did, good and bad? Yeah, a lot of ups and downs. Um, you know, I think any win is a good win, but there's definitely some stuff to clean up um, in terms of just communication and tackling. But I really like. I mean, you know, we fought, we finished. Um, that that goal line stand, like seeing Chris Jackson and everyone, Harold and all those guys, like make that play. You know, I have faith in him and, and um, you know, obviously a huge part of the game. Elijah, has anything surprised you about the transition of the NFL so far and kind of your journey to this point? Um, I mean, I, I think, I mean, growing up, you know, with my dad and all that stuff, like he gave me all the tips and reminders and stuff. But at the end of the day, like this is, this is my um, life story that I'm living. And, you know, there's you – know, like, like, there's going to be ups and downs, you know what I mean? And, you know, in the moment of a down is misery, but then eventually, you know, you wake up one day and then you're, you're back, you're back on the, back on the horse, you know what I mean? So, um, I'm loving the journey so far and I, I've learned so much from g the good plays and the bad plays, especially the bad ones. So I'm, I'm just looking for the, you know, what I can do, how I can help the team next week.